Forever 21 stuff. Here's kind of like the design of them. They have like. Hello, you guys. What is up? Welcome back to my channel. I feel like I start the intros to all of my vlogs weird. I can't get comfy in this seat. <sighs> yeah. I don't know why. Like, I keep losing my breath lately. It's very bizarre. But um, it's a very, very random time to start a vlog. But it's 419. And I was like, you know what? I just miss them. I was just watching Libby Christensen's vlog. And I was like, I miss chatting with them. So. I was like, you know what, I'm going to chat with them. I just got home, so I worked from 4.30 a.m. to 12 p.m. today, well, 12.30, and then came home. I rested for about, I'd say, like, 20 minutes to half an hour, and then I got up, I went, and I lifted, and yeah, so it's 4.19 now. I am home. I made myself something to eat. I was just messing with my camera. A very random meal, but I honestly feel like we don't have many groceries, but so on there, I just have, it's two pieces of ham there's a slice of swiss cheese which looks very funny on there it's like the ultra thin cheese it's like 40 calories from the brand's like sargento or something i don't know i really like it and then a whole egg so two pieces of ham on there um a sl thin slice of swiss cheese and then a whole egg and then this is like the Sara lee delightful 45 calorie bread and i have two of those so that's that i'm gonna eat this watch some youtube i just wanted to enter the vlog show you guys what i'm eating and then yeah, I'm planning on making like homemade egg rolls, trying to make those for dinner for Scott. So I feel like that would be really fun to bring you guys along. And like I said, I just genuinely missed you. I got a new memory card, which is in my camera right now. I'm super excited. It took me so damn long to get this open because I was just like ripping it with my hands because I'm too stubborn to go get scissors like it says. So that is that. And exciting news. I haven't talked to you guys. So I finally purchased the course to do to get my... If I can speak. I finally purchased the course to become a certified personal trainer. So after I eat and everything and relax for a little bit, I am going to be doing one of like the courses. I printed out the like textbook, like that whole chapter and everything. So that is that. I'm really excited and it's just like crazy. It's coming full fruition now, like my account growing. And then I'm like, oh my god, like eventually launching my business and stuff like after graduation. It's just going to be insane and it's kind of finally hitting me. Like it's about to hit 2021. I graduate like all my whole life. All I've known is school because like, but now I'm going to be graduating and it's like, it's just going to be crazy. So that's that. I'm going to stop talking while my food is still hot and I will chat with you guys in a bit. Guys, let's go. First of all, I just had two of these little like, they look like little Reese cups. But they're almond butter cups because I was craving something sweet and my coworker got me that for Secret Santa. We got the goods. They're so kind and they put it in here if it's like raining. I love that. Go UPS. I know this is my Flex Pro Meals. Yeah, yeah. I'm so happy. I literally, you guys, I have missed having these for work. Like so freaking much. I got the backyard barbecue. I got seven of those. I got seven of the cauliflower pizza, and then I got six of the homestyle chicken and mac, and then two of the power treats, which is like the protein balls. In case you guys are curious, like here's how it just like comes packaged. There is like these giant gel ice packs. They used to use freeze dried ice. I don't know why they switched, but I honestly like those more because you can keep them. There's that. I'll put that away in a moment. But the Forever 21 stuff, you guys, I have been wanting some cropped freaking hoodies that have like like a zip up crop hoodie. I have been wanting some. I haven't been able to find any that I really liked. And I was looking at Forever 21. I saw them. So your girl placed an order. And of course, I always have to spend enough to get free shipping. One, two, three, four. And five. Okay, I don't want to brawl in right now, so I'm going to go throw on a sports bra, and then I'll show you what these babies look like. Okay, okay, you guys. I'm going to try on this first. So, does it say the name on here? It'll probably say on the tag. But, like I said, this is all from Forever 21. Okay, so, casual jacket, olive green. Okay, yeah, it doesn't say the actual name. I don't know. So, you guys are... You guys, this is so soft. Ah, this is a good purchase. This was very much so an impulse thing just because I didn't have enough for free shipping and I was like, 
I, I need to get free shipping, of course. So I was like, I'll just add this in. So let's toss this baby on. The inside is just like, it's not like the fuzzy. It's just like that material. Oh, you guys, I'm obsessed. And then there's this little drawstring. Catch me living in this. Catch me living in this, man. You can tighten it. You tuck that up. You guys, this is... Hey. Hey, there, buddy. You like my... You like my quarter zip? My crop quarter zip? Wait, how do people do that? Weird. Um, I love this. Very, very happy with this purchase. Literally so freaking soft. Oh, sorry, kitty. Okay. Next up, I'm probably going to put that back on, honestly. Next up, we got this top. I mainly got the ones. So the, these next four that I'm about to show you, those are why I like place this order. I got them for working out because I love working out. I'm not comfortable enough because like I, it's, I live in a small town. Like people like my principal go to my gym. So I'm not comfortable enough to just train in a sports bra only. So I, I got these. So then I like to have just like a zip up. Then I can toss on. Oh, I already know I'm loving this. <gasps> you can feel it's not like, okay. Cropped zip up. So however much you desire to zip it up. There's my, there's my belly button. Excuse my outfit. Um, there's where it falls. It has these little drawstrings right here. So you can cinch it up. Then tuck those in. I obviously would be cuter with leggings on, but I don't have those on right now. And it's like that windbreaker kind of material. It's a little bit different than the typical windbreaker material. I really like it. There is a hood. This is a steal, ladies. Get this. This is. Y'all gonna see me in my workout videos and you're gonna be like, I should have bought it. I should have bought it. And I'm gonna be like, it's too late now. It is too late now. So hop on over there and get that. I don't know. Like, it doesn't really show the name. Maybe. I can look on the site if I'm really feeling nice. This is a pullover. I got um, mediums in both of those, right? Yeah. Yeah, those are both mediums. I got this pullover in a large just because I wanted it to be a bit oversized. I'm gonna have to clean my office today, so I feel like you guys will enjoy seeing that as well. Oh my God, I'm already so, you guys, this is phenomenal. Best order I've made. Oh, 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 you guys, I want one in every color. And oh my God, cuffing the sleeve. This is like such a soft, like comfy material. Like it's not crazy thick. You guys, I have been, when I tell you, I've been looking for something like this for so long and I just couldn't find something that was cheap. Let me just tell you, I paid like $55 for all of this. All five of those items, I paid like 55 bucks. Free shipping too, free shipping, man. I'm getting hyped. This is so cute. It's a little just like crop quarters. In. I've been saying I need to save money. But like I want to order every color. I love it. That's so cozy. Or do I want to keep this one on afterwards? I don't know. Okay, next two things. Both medium, same exact thing, just different colors. Zip up. I want a long life. A legendary one. Kind of wish I would have got a large in these. It's not like crazy tight. Okay. So whenever this is zipped up, it kind of like cuts down right there. But obviously like whenever I'm just wearing it in the gym, probably just going to wear it like this. It's comfy though. I got a medium. There is a hood. I want a long life. A legendary one. Wow. I love this. Literally. Wow. I'm living footies all. I'm really sad I didn't get a large in those. And I'm too impatient to return them and get different ones, so that's fine. And then the same color, just like it said, like taupe, taupe or top. I don't know how you say that color. T A U P E. I'm gonna try it on also for shits and giggles, even though I know exactly how it fits. My ass is pale, so catch me wearing this. This is the only two colors I had. And I know I'd love it, so that's why I got both. Uh, this will look good whenever I'm tanned. Right now, I'm like. 
just I'm right now I'm pale as shit, so it kind of looks funky. So yeah, there's no pockets or anything. I don't know how much I like this one. I just realized you can't tell in the black, but like this type of type of stuff. I don't know how much I like that. I don't give a shit though. I'll still wear. I think this would be cute more so like. Just like a casual with like a cute pair of sweats or jeans. I go with it. I would wear this around like just like casual like to the mall. Or we just hanging out with some friends. You guys, I'm so happy. So, 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 so stinking happy with that purchase. Literally love that. I think I'm going to put on the black pullover right now because this, this is probably my favorite out of everything. I'm just a whore for quarter zips and like crew necks. So... Just blew me away, man. Blew me away. I already know you guys are going to be over there. I'll tell going to be like, where is that from? Where is that from? Forever 21. Forever 21, honestly. Y'all don't disappoint me. Fun fact, I got all this shit from the sale. Like the clearance. Um, section 2 on the website. So, that's that. I'm going to shut up now and put this crap away. But, that is that. And then I need to work on my laptop a little bit. I think I might edit a video. I don't know. I need to do the personal trainer stuff, but I kind of need to edit too. Okay, right here, I just cut up chicken in very small pieces, and then it's just like a slaw mix that has like broccoli, and then it has like Brussels sprouts, some carrots, I don't know what else. Well, it's called a super blend, so Brussels sprouts, Napa cabbage, kohlrabi, I don't know what that is, broccoli, carrots, and kale. That is the mix that's in there with the chicken. Okay, so this is what I'm adding in. Guys, here's the finished product. That one kind of looks funky, but I swear it's not. And then the sweet and sour sauce, and we're just sharing a plate. <laughs> Quizzy, how is so quizzy? This quizzy likes to cuddle. The quizzy does like to cuddle. I know. <laughs> She's always by my head when I wake up. Say good morning to the vlog. Good morning, vlog. <laughs> this is Scotty P in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> funny funny okay hello you guys what is up good morning um scott and i did sleep in until nine today so well, i don't even know what time it is i haven't been on my phone for a hot minute whenever i'm actually trying to like really focus and get stuff done i take off my apple watch just so like i don't see people's notifications and it's not really good morning at this point it's 12.01 so that's that okay so i have basically spent the morning um like i said we slept until nine so i've only been up for three hours i'm gonna go ahead and put this back on so i don't forget it but yeah i have been working on my personal trainer course stuff so right now i watched the videos and then i'm on page 10 i've read this stuff so far so i'm on page 10 how many pages are even in this so there's 15 pages so I have five more pages to go chapter one and then I'm going to take the quiz and we'll look over like the chapter review thing and then I'm going to take the quiz I am highlighting in here 
And I just kind of printed this out and stapled it like a little book for chapter one. I don't know if I'm going to print out every single one of them because it is like a shit ton of ink. So I may, I may not, I don't really know yet. But yeah, so I have this. I'm going to finish reading these, reading this. And then I'm also, while I was reading that um, for the second portion, I was stretching and then I just went in the room and got the massage done. So I'm going to finish up reading, kind of stretch, massage my body because my whole body is entirely sore, but, um, okay, but yeah, so I'm going to use the massage gun and I am going to, my, like, it's more so my quads aren't sore or anything, but like my hamstrings and then my calves are kind of tight right now and yesterday I did back, so my back is very sore along with um, my biceps because I also back in biceps, but I've been incorporating more so like I've almost honestly been separating it I used to always do like usually like a push pull and then I would do like quads and hamstring or not quads and hamstring quads and glutes hamstrings and glutes But I've kind of just been more so doing it like upper body and then I do like lower body and focusing on it like that Because I'm really trying to focus more on so like functional training. I want to get better with my speed agility that type of gist so and just like my stability and having just overall like being very functional like plyometrics that's what I'm kind of dabbling in more now which I've always loved that that's why at the beginning of my fitness journey I was always doing hit exercises I just love being able to do like very complex movements and be very fast at it so right now I feel like I'm really finding the balance but I also want to be very strong so I'm trying to find the balance between being very functional getting good at like plyometrics and also and then like calisthenics and then but also being able to like be hella strong fit bexy is like her name on instagram i honestly don't know like her real name i know she's talked on her story before like her people call her bex that's like her nickname but i don't actually know her real name anyways she is my main motivation literally for like her style of training i love it so much like she posted a video today like the girl was freaking sumo deadlifting 265 but also she has like just like crazy speed and agility and it's just like i love it so much so i'm gonna stop rambling with that continue to read got my dandy highlighter and my h2o and my massage gun i really am trying to save up i also did budget some to figure out like how I'm gonna be investing like how much and I put actual like dollar amounts but I think because obviously my I'm not on salary so my pay varies um bi-weekly whenever I get paid because I get paid bi-weekly so every two weeks it's not like my paycheck is the same so having the exact number I think I'm gonna do like percentages that way I can take my total pay and then do percentages from that but that's very very off topic and I'm going to shut the hell up now I'm on my own, broken alone. I feel the rain crashing down. All around this empty town, I'm searching for the lost and found. But you don't care, you're unaware. Keep moving like the scars aren't even there. It's in the air, like a blazing flare. Officially gonna murder Scott. <laughs> Stupid dickhead. Just kidding, love you. He's been a butthole. He's saying my workouts are shit. And he was trying to not let me use his pre-workout. Even though every protein he uses is one that I purchased for him. Yeah, nice stuff. Except that select that Cause you know you said you like Bomar stuff. Okay, I'm taking about this much of a scoop of Redcon Total War, and it's the pineapple juice flavor. And same goes. Which one's that? That one's almost gone. 
<laughs> and then the same amount for the Total War Blue Raspberry. <laughs> Will you actually try some of this together, though? No. Why? And you're not going to take a tiny sip? No, that's actually caffeine. Bruh, caffeine ain't going to hurt you. I drink a coffee, a pre-workout. That's why you don't have to do workouts. I have great workouts. No, you don't. Yes, I do. You're lying to right now. How do I not have good workouts? Because you don't. You guys back me up. I post. I'm like, wow, what a good session. What a <laughs> Girls, why y'all fighting? Okay, I'm going to change out the battery in this, and I'm going to fill my lift today. I got a Gymshark package in the mail. Oh, oh my goodness. Mm. I drooled. I wonder if you tell me that. Yo, Gymshark mask. Physique check. Mm. <laughs> oh, they're like a... That's weird, it's almost like a spandex you get cotton at the same time. What material is a tag that you can take off? Nylon. My ass acting like I know what that stuff means. It has adjustable ears. Oh, this is nice. I really like this. So, $15 for a two-pack. Got two of these. Just black has the low-key Gymshark logo. We love that. And then... I got a pair of the gray, what kind of training bottoms, so training joggers. They're just gray. I get a size large. I have the dark blue pair already, so I know I love them. They're just more like baggy than they are joggers, so they get tired at the ankle. I just love lounging around the house in these, and gray sweats are always a move. There's those, and this is what I'm excited. I got some of the new Hyper Seamless leggings, so I just got the black and, well, like the gray mostly with the black detailing we have the bum right there that's really flattering so i'll try these on real quick a lot of people said they are the same as the adapt Marl. i think these feel a bit more stretchy they feel like a combination of the adapt Marl material as of right now i'll wait and see when i put them on in the camo because the camo is a bit even though they're all part of the adapt line the camo is definitely far stretchier than like the typical adapt Marl. but that's that I'm gonna try these on. Okay guys, here these babies are. So, let me put you in the light more. But here these are, here's kind of like the design of them. They have like a ribbing, double paneled. Yeah, yeah, that's double paneled. Double panning panel on the waistband. Here is, they have the glue like, so they're really flattering because the double paneling goes along there. So it really accentuates like your butt shape, makes it a little more like bubbly round. Overall, I really like them, so here are these. I'm about to hang them up in my closet. I've had so many and tried so many different collections, and I still have some that aren't even hung up, just ones I genuinely don't wear. <laughs> Look like a little stock over there. It's very dark in here, but I don't have time to explain or 
turn on the light, not explain. I am explaining right now. We are going to dinner. It's kind of a last minute thing with Scott's family and like his mom's best friends in town. She lives in Florida and then they're just, it's just going to be a group dinner. I don't really know everyone there, but that's okay. Just Scott's family and all of their friends. So we're going to go to that. We're just going to beat ups. It's pretty chill, but I did. Um, I curled like a front piece of my hair, barely anything though, because I don't have time. Put on a tiny bit of makeup, and then I just have on the Sherpa that I showed you guys, jeans, and my Hey Dude. So that's that. I'm not bringing my camera. I will try to record some on my phone, but I don't know how comfortable I'll be doing that. It's currently 10.07, it's New Year's Eve. Um, as you can tell, I'm not having a crazy eventful, I'm not going to a party or anything. Um, New Year's Eve, I actually just finished um, printing off the Greg Doucette and a Ball Cookbook, 102 pages. I didn't, it didn't give me the option to do front and back, so here this is, it took so long, it literally took two and a half like ink cartridges. So that was very, very obnoxious, but I'm really happy. Scott wanted this to be like actually like this. Um, I don't have a hole puncher. I didn't really think about that till we had already left the store, but I'm just gonna take in this to the gym on Monday and they have a hole puncher in the office there. And uh, like obviously Scott works there. I'm pretty close with the staff. They're not gonna care if I use their damn hole puncher. So I'm gonna have to obviously do it in like small stacks, but I'm gonna do that. And then I have, ugh, I have this binder that was literally from my accounting class. I think is actually what this binder was from. That's just what I'm gonna use to put the Greg set thing in. I also got him three of Gigi Mufu's eBooks, but those are over 500 pages for those. I'm not gonna be able to print those off. So he was like, that's fine. Um, I just wanted to make sure I got the recipe book printed off for him, but I'm definitely not doing that. It would just be so much money in ink because the ink's like 20 bucks. Okay, that's a little exaggerated. It's like 17 bucks, um, an ink cartridge, so that's just really expensive. But I have, yeah, as you would have seen, just literally been, um, reading in my textbook and I've been highlighting things and then I'm starting to add notes and yeah. So that is really that. I'm honestly going to close off this vlog here. By the way, I don't know if I told you after, whenever we went to dinner, it was really good. Like the food wasn't spectacular. It honestly took so freaking long to get our food, but that's fine. I get it. It's New Year's Eve. Like it's honestly whatever. It's beat ups on, on like a holiday night. So it's going to be busy, but so we got our food it was just really nice to talk to people and like jenny which is scott's mom's best friend she lives in florida so it's not like she's down here much and whenever we actually went to florida we stayed with her which is like whenever i met her for the first time she's super nice so it was just like nice talking with them and then i got to meet um a lot of scott's mom's other friends and it was just fun i honestly really like talking to them and just I don't know, they're just funny and stuff. And now that I'm at the age, it's like obviously talking to like little kids. Like I'm not a little kid anymore, so like adult conversation is fun for me. So that was nice to do. But yeah, I'm going to end off this vlog here. I'm literally just going to continue to drink my water. And yeah, drink my water and read some more. But here, I'm gonna finish up pretty soon though because it's getting to the point I'm just so tired that nothing's processing. Yeah. I have to work at 7 a.m. So I'm gonna have to get up at like, I don't know, probably like 5.45. I was gonna say 5.30, but I wanna sleep in um, some, so 
and then I need to leave the house by 6.15 to drive to work to be there at 7 a.m. But yeah, I, I don't really work too terribly long. But okay, I'm gonna stop talking because I'm rambling at this point. I love you guys so much. It was kind of a random vlog, but I hope you enjoyed it and I will talk to you in the next one. Thank <laughs> you.